so now what we are going to learn in this one is subtraction trust me there are lot of sums on the subtraction generally all we learn subtraction by borrowing method but in competitive exam what will happen if the digits are missing in subtraction sum some digits are missing and we have to complete that subtraction sum then how to solve this one so here we are going to learn the subtraction just simple thing i am asking you question suppose on one paper there are 10 additions and 10 subtractions are given and the choice is given naturally i feel everybody will go for the addition so addition is our strong point so then why not to learn subtraction by addition method so here is the first term how we are learning subtraction by addition method what minus 2 is 5 so subtraction by addition method so do the addition of this one 5 plus 2 is 7 always go from the bottom bottom to top second sum same technique we are going to use here 4 dash 3 minus dash 5 dash and the answer of this one is 234 now how to solve this one these are very typical questions of competitive exam okay so what we have learned the technique from bottom to top 4 plus what it's 13 9 4 plus 9 is 13 this is a two digit number so this is always a next number so this is 6 3 plus 6 is 9 9 is a single digit so this is normal 2 plus what is 4 so 2 so this is the answer one more sum for this one this is dash 3 dash minus 2 dash 7 and the answer of this one is 598 now pay attention how to solve this one again subtraction by addition method from bottom to top 8 plus 7 is 15 one is carry or miss this is the next number we, we don't know what number is here so first solve normal way 9 plus what is 13 4 but 4 is the next number so this digit has to be 3 again one more time 8 plus 7 is 15 now check here next number 4 9 plus 4 is 13 this is a two digit number this is the next number so this is 3 5 plus 3 is 8 i hope you understood thank you so for more practice for more perfection and just to develop the interest i am giving you two more sums so please keep on solving these sums so you will not forget it remember when we listen might be possible we will forget but when we write we never forget so you solve this one with the help of pen and pencil and write your comments in the comment section thank you